question is after gathering 770 chestnuts three girls divided them up so that the amounts were in the same proportion of their ages as often as mary took four chestnuts nelly took three and for every six that mary took susie took seven how many chestnuts did each girl get how many chestnuts did each girl get so this is a question on quantity aptitude question on ratios and proportion this is a question on ratios and proportions ratios will always be maintained ratios will always be maintained see what it says is whenever mary is taking four whenever mary is taking four nelly is taking three whenever mary is taking four nelly is taking three i am just giving an example i am just conveying it i have nothing to do with the question as of now see if this is taking four she is taking three minutes if she is taking one into four she is taking one into three if mary is taking four into two then this also she nelly will also take three into two if she is taking four into three nelly will take three into three so for every eight she will take she will take six for every 12 mary takes she will take nine like this so i'm just wrapping it up so this is the way of doing it this is the way of doing it the ratio will always be multi will have to multiply by the same number it will always be maintained so what happens is whenever mary is taking four whenever mary is taking four nelly is taking three whenever mary is taking one nelly is taking three and whenever mary is taking six susi is taking seven susi is taking seven So these are the three girls, Mary, Nelly, and Susie. Whenever Mary is taking four, Nelly is taking three. Whenever Mary is taking six, Susie is taking seven. As I explained it here, if Mary is going to take six, she will take seven. If she is going to take six or two, she will take seven or two. If she is going to take six or three, they will take seven or two like that. Now here Mary is a common element. Here Mary is a common element. The best way to do is finding out the LCM of Mary, which is four and six. My LCM of four and six will be twelve. But for the sake of convenience, LCM is 12. But for the sake of convenience, I am making it as 6 into 4. I am multiplying this by 6, this by 4. So whenever Mary is taking 4, now what has happened is this 4 has got multiplied by 6. Therefore, this 3 will have to get multiplied by 6. 3 into 6 will be 18. Now this 6 has got multiplied by 4. This 7 also will have to get multiplied by 4 will be 28. So normally, I will take the LCM and proceed because this is going to be a bigger number. So I just did it like that because it's going to be more than the LCM. Now, because the ratio is 24 to 18 is 28, multiply by the same number. Let the variable be x, x and x. So Mary will be taking 24 into x, Nelly will be taking 18 into x, Susie will be taking 28 into x. Now add all this because the total number of chestnuts is 70. They will be dividing seventy chestnuts in this ratio. They will be dividing the seven seven thousand chestnuts in this ratio. Now, when you total this, this is twenty-four plus eighteen is forty-two plus twenty-eight will be seventy. So seventy x will be equal to seven seventy. Seventy x will be equal to seven seventy, or x will be equal to eleven. X will be equal to eleven. Once you know x is eleven, they ask for how much each girl will get. So Mary will be getting 24 into 7. Mary will be getting 24 into 11 will be 264. So the easy way of doing 11 is multiplication of 11, 24 into 11. So whenever you get two numbers to so multiply by 11, right hand side will be 4, left hand side will be 2, center will be 2 plus 4, 6. As simple as this. Right hand side is 4, left hand side will be 2. Add this 2, the center number will be 2 plus 6. Same thing is here, 18 into 11. So right hand side will be 8. Left hand side will be one. This will be one ninety eight. So here, it will right hand side is eight. Left hand side will be two. But when I add two plus eight, this will become ten. I cannot write ten in between. So this will become zero, and this will be three not eight. So this is easy way of doing your multiplication by eleven. So Mary will be getting two sixty four. Nelly will be getting one ninety eight, and Susie will be getting three zero eight. Susie will be getting three zero eight. Subscribe to my channel. I'll be adding questions every now and then.